What's going on everybody? Sharpie360 here and welcome to episode 3 of Rambles Tale in Enshrouded. Today we are going to go over to the west side of the Springland and we have a couple of things we're going to do. We're going to go check out Rookmore over here and we're going to swing over to this obelisk and go pick up the alchemist here and then possibly check out the salt mine location so we can make some dried fur and that will enable us to craft a backpack bigger than what we have now so oh look at that i should probably attach that ring equip sweet and okay cool so this is our little Springlands base right now and we have oswald and we have athlon and we're gonna go get Balthazar, the alchemist, the one that's leaving all the writings all over the land. So it'll be pretty fun. And then hopefully we can get some better gear with uh, Oswald at that point too. It'll be sweet. We need to make ourselves a forge next with him. Get some charcoal going. Scrap metal, all that stuff. So we should be able to get that done when we get back. I believe I have some charcoal already made. Look at that. Sweet. the flame have anything the hunter is alive perhaps she can reveal a thing or two about survival in the lands okay so that's pretty much all we got right here for now so let's head over to the west side of the springlands and see what's going on over there and if you find this episode entertaining at all make sure to hit that like button and possibly subscribe and i would greatly appreciate it actually since we have the spire unlocked we can just start up there we should just do that all right, sweet. All right, here we go. Heading to the south now, basically, because what we're going to go to first is Rookmore, because there's the quest here for Oswald Forge weaponry or armor. So we'll check that out first. And let's go. Woo! A dive bomb straight into enemy territory. You should probably uh, land on the outside and get some constitution. Built up lest I get my booty beat. I right, gotta do it. Get out of here, Wolfo. Oh. <laughs> All right. There we are. I keep collecting those shroud spores because I need. As many as I can. Shroud cores are essential. What's up, dog? Oh, we got three of them. Alright, you guys come over here away from that range, dude, and I will fight you out out to sad here. <laughs> Staggered him. Oh. Oh, he got me. Jeez. One more hit. One more hit. There we go. Nice. Oh, the bones again. I need the scrap. The metal scrap. I'll just take all of the goodness. There we are. Who's next? Oh yeah, I gotta use the axe. There we go. <laughs> Water. I don't mind if I do. Ooh, well, there's a whole, a nice size hole right here in the wall. It would have worked as well. Hello, skeevers. Yep. Little rats. Dire rats. Explosive powder ball, yay. Alright, right. Oh god. Get out of your rats. I'll fight you with my stone pickaxe, that's right. <laughs> Woo, executioner's axe, alright, well. You can go ahead and just salvage that right away. 
seen enough. Let's go. No double jump. There we are. There's a well here. I will stop and grab myself a bit of a drink. Alright, sweet. What's up, dude? Creepy armor, it looks like. Nice. Give me the scrap and the fur. Here you are, trying to walk through the wall. Not the brightest character, are you? Screw that place over there because I've died so many times to that area, it's not even funny. Oh. Nothing even good in here. Oh. Blew all the loot to smithereens. For sweet small backpack at the hunter. Cool, we can make it right away. Well, actually, I think we'll need more than just the one, but that's what we need to make with the fur rack, drying rack. Hence why we need to go to the salt mine. Yep. Alright. Chest? Don't mind if I do. Oh. I like the water better than the explosive barrels. Bombs. Alright. Cool. I think uh, this is the last little spot. Nothing too crazy out here. There's a thing to read over there. Okay. Oh. Get him from behind. Yeah. Nice. Gotcha. That'll work. All right, let's, uh, we got this chest right here. Sweet. Shepherd's staff. All right, I think, uh, we got that already. Yeah, so we upgraded the other one already fully, too. All right, scrap metal. Sweet. And remote note. A cold reception. We've arrived at Rookmore, finally out of the shrouded lands. It was a difficult journey from the mountains. I'd hoped for a field hospital here, but there's almost nothing. I must take matters in my own hands, as I dead at the front. I'll set up camp in Woodguard. Nice, okay, cool. Alright, I think that's everything in this. Let's continue onwards. We need to go... Oh, that's telling us to keep going. Okay, I see. Gives us the next location on our destination journey. Sweet. Heading down into the shroud. Let's go. Dangerous lands afoot. I'm going to go off the beaten path and try and find a couple baddies. One of these critters. Well, they give good XP right now because I'm only level 3. That's good. And Shroud Liquid. Alright. 5 minutes and 30 seconds of enshrouded time. I think we'll be alright. Alright. 
more shroud liquid in a rock. Nope, we got, we got guys surrounding me. Oh god, oh god, <laughs> oh god, oh man. Oh, a broadsword guy, I see how it's gonna go. Come on, skip, go this way. Ooh, missed me. Gotcha. I will take your remains. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> how do you like me now? Got him. Sweet seven runes with that guy. Damn. Keep our eyes peeled so we don't touch any of that red stuff. Is that a road? Oh, it's just the road. Okay, cool. <laughs> Hundred meters out. What have we here? We have arrived at Woodguard. Nice. I'm gonna lockpick. I'll take that. Sweet. Is this telling me I need to mine through it? Oh, mycelium! What's back here? Anything cool? No. Okay. What about this side? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Alright, let's see. What else do we got here? Uh, is that it? No, we got plenty of stuff to explore around this part. Critters. Oh god, I should actually pull out, use my axe for right now. When I need my sword, I don't want it to be completely busted. I think there might be uh, an anvil around somewhere, though. Keep an eye out for it. Speaking of a caution time, I should probably find... Uh, not dwell too much down here. I am under the two-minute mark. Here we are. Woo! I can breathe again! Don't want that stuff. I guess the salt would be fine, but we'll get so much salt. Alright, right, here we are. Peaceful Acres, I think it's called. Woodguard, Peaceful Acres, somewhere over this way, a bit further. A small caravan of refugees arrived today from the Kindle Wastes. A long journey. I've never been good with strangers, but there is no time to tattle. I dove into work, dressing the wounds, a battle for life and death even now. Sadly, some lost. We put the rest we put them to rest in the crypt below. May the northern winds guide them to the afterlife. There's one who might live despite it all. A deep leg wound, but maybe not too far gone. The wounded Salem smiles a lot, says he owes his life. Just luck, I think. Salem? Salim? Not sure. This must be him. Hey, Salem. Salamander. What are you doing, bud? Oh, that hurt. Ghostly ghoulmans. Alright, they have the salt. The salt of the earth. Read. A new season. The new arrivals have wasted no time breaking ground, building something. Their determination is fanatical. A flame sanctum, Salem says. Some nights have lingered near the caravan, Salem insists, over the fire. They talk of their homes, the sands, the creeping ruin. So much sorrow. Salem sends them like a daffodil. The first sign of spring. He is a fool, though a sweet one. Alright, what do we got down here? It's night time. We got this little crypt we can uh, fight. This is that little side quest. We open this and then we get Onslaught catapulted, bombarded by those ghost guys. So, let's see. Uh, give me my weapon. There we go. 
I'll take it. Run away! Just kidding. Need that XP. Oh man, look at them all. skilled in the fighting department, so I think we'll be alright. I'll just take the salt from him. Nice. And the other side really quick. What's up, Budrix? Oh, man, get him. Stuck me with his cold demon bones. Just two on this side? Alright, what about these sarcophaguses? No? Okay. Sweet, that's all we need. I'm gonna check this little uh, hut over here really quick. Can't really see anything. Alright, so what we are going to do, what is this one? This is the ancient obelisk. We'll set that as a waypoint. We'll go into the crafting menu. Oh, we gotta harvest a bit of stone first. Let's see. Wood God. Wood Godium Leviosa. Yeah, this will be work. I just need to get a little bit further down. Give me some stone. There we are. Okay. And with that... Actually, I need to clear up some spots here. These can go... These can go... That can go. This can go. These can go. Excellent. Okay, crafting, flame altar, made. And we'll just come over here. There we are. Sweet. Now we have that quest complete for placing a second flame altar as well. Let's well, sweet. Let's head back to uh, our base and rest for the night. Drop off some of the gear and we can transport right back over here. Alright, let's see. Drop stuff here if I got it. Okay. And put the stuff away that I have not put away yet either. Let's just check Athlon and see how much it takes for that backpack. Three. Or four. So I need three torn cloth, four dried fur, and five string. We'll Alright, cool. Everything is away. Let's give myself a quick repair and sleep. Alright, morning time. Excellent. And let's head straight back to where we placed that flame altar at. Here we are. Excellent. And then, what we can do with this is just extinguish it. So I'll put it, if we do keep one over here for the time being, I will put it a little bit further out than right there. Give me that, honey, and wax, sweet. Alright, speaking of which, which way do we need to go? This is Woodguard. We put it... Oh, we went east, we should have gone west further. Okay, whatever, that's fine. It's going away anyways. Alright, we're heading west. Is this actually, can I dig this up? Is this farm soil? It is. Sweet. You can make that, but you can also mine it. I didn't know that they had it here. Sweet. Give me that corn. Corn cob. Those give you a plus two strength if you roast them and eat them. And this little building. Hello? Ooh, creepy. Hello?
Any cool chests in here? Any gear? Let's check upstairs. Big hole in the wall. I guess that's pretty cool. Pretty cute. Oh. Well, we had something blowing in the other room. Oh yeah, we got insects. Oh man. Get him. Boom. <laughs> There's one way to take care of your pest problem. Here's a chest. Flint arrows. Sweet. And a scroll. My final journey. My brother, all hope seems to be lost for me. The nurse, Helen, says there's nothing for me to do but rest. But I won't have it. The people of the Kindle Wastes, they speak of the ancients as if they could do anything. Do you recall the obelisks? Where we used to play as children? I will make my way there, no matter what. Perhaps there is a cure for me yet. Do not follow. You can't stop me. Mattel. Alright, bud. You and I are heading to the same spot. Sweet. Beehive. This would be a pretty fun spot to build a, a base. Nice big open area. Pepperoni. Oh, you missed. So did I. There we go. Sweet. Back into the shroud we go. Oh god. I don't like falling into those little spots. What is that? Here we are. That was a quick little pocket. Oh. <laughs> Did not work. There we go. Sweet. Alright. Heading up. We gotta head up. Location is above. Don't tell me I gotta backtrack a bunch. Probably not. Let's see. We'll just swing over around this bend here and see what's up. Oh, I think that's the road we need to be on, actually. That'll work just fine. Alright, let's follow this road and see where it leads. Well, the insects, they harbor a vengeance. Here we are. Some random shack. <laughs> well, in cottage in thing. Bigger than a shack. Peaceful acres. Alright, here we are. At peaceful acres. Wow. Oh, we got the rat. And another one. Here's a chest. Quick little chest. Quick little chest. Sweet. Mm, metal star mace. Here's another chest. Oh, wow. Couple more rats to take care of. That is just fine. Let's just keep moving. A lot of those little buildings are just gonna have like pretty generic chests in them right now, a treasure and stuff. A shroud chasm down there. I think a shroud root is down there. Let's see. We need to go. Where do we need to go? Oh, we need to get out of the way of the pupper. Nice. Level four. Hell yeah. All right. Sweet. Skills. What do we got? We got the double jump? Oh, yeah. We got to get two of those. All right. So I guess we'll just level up one more time to get that double jump. Need it. 30 meters away. 
There it is. All right, sweet. We made it. Ancient obelisk. In a world destined for ruin, humanity will fade, as all beings do. Their light will flicker and die, untouched by the eternal flame. Meaningless and minuscule, in the face of near-endless insight, burning brightly. Turning to dust, we turn to fire. An endless cycle of ruin and turmoil. Alright, what are these guys doing? Wanderer's boots. Oh, nice. Tired. We would pretend to read them as children, but now, the obelisks hide their truth. I was a fool for thinking I could find a solution to my problems here. No one hears my prayers, and I feel so tired. I wish you were by my side, brother. Forgive me, Vatel. That must be Vatel right there. <laughs> oh, poor bud. Well, you tried. Let's put those boots on, though. Get them Wanderer's Boots, plus two Stamina Regen, and better... Well, no, about the same physical resistance and magical resistance. Sweet. Okay, that part is done. Next stop is the Ancient Vault, which is just a hop, skip, and a jump of that away. I'm gonna stop off and grab this bee wax really quick. Nice. Ready? And go! Alright, we have arrived. We need to actually get there to the front door. Ancient vault, alchemist. There we are. Oh, yeah, there's some danguses down here. I just go get this guy, get the XP. in the mud pit, Budrick. Nice. Okay. Cool. Another guy. Nice. Parry and stagger. Get him before he gets me. Oh, you got me. Alright, there is a note over here. I'm gonna read that. Stashed our hall. That hall was too good to share with the rest of those snarling cutthroats, so I stashed the deadliest bits in the last place anyone would look. You know the cave well enough. I do. Do I? Ow. I remember reading that. Oh, one more guy. Yes. Oh, a couple more guys, I guess. Nice. You can't get me on the gingerbread, man. Sweet. There's some water here. Excellent. Okay. Is that it? Alright. Good enough, at least. So I think this one is going to be a bit of a puzzle as well. Let's just see what happens here. Or it could have just been ransacked. Yeah, I think it's actually just a stronghold. Oh, there's buttons here. Oh, sweet. And I'm out of energy. 
Oh god. Alright. Very cool. Got a bunch of scrap metal. Alright, so this is the way we need to go to get the chest. Give me something good. Apprentice wand. Yay! Oh. Yeah, that's right. Now they start. Here we are. Excellent. We cut this one down. The chest here. Bombs in it. Yay. Okay, let's see here. I'm actually gonna salvage this. And this. And delete that. And delete that. That can stay. That can stay. Okay. Wonderful. Alright, let's see. Location above. This way above. Is there anything this way though? Mm, I think that's just the other. Oh, there's a trap right there. Hmm. This is where he's gonna be. You know, unlock him. Uh, yeah, looks like it. Oh, there's a couple guys up here. Wicked way! Oh. Sweet. Got him. Four metal scrap? Heck yeah. Three? Oh, nice. Here we go. Give myself a quick repair. Nice. And, hello, Balthazar. Woo! Alright, cool. We have a bunch of recipes unlocked now. What is that? Collect what? Flint arrow? Okay. Let me come up here. Anything, anything good up here? Not really. There's a door. This leads to the outside, okay. Righteous. Okay, well that spot is cleared up, so that scavenger's cave, what is this? Scavenger's stash is right here. We'll check out that spot, run up to the salt mines over here, and then we'll head back to base. Fly! Oh, there's a chest right there. Oh, no. I'll have to remember that. It's probably something cool like a shepherd's staff. Alright, that cave entrance looks suspiciously like the cave entrance we're looking for. Bomb! Nice. Oh, which one of you is the traitor? Oh, he got hit by his own trap. Nice. Hey, which one is you? It's a traitor. Where can I get my hands on this stash? Nice. Triple kill. We'll have to dump some of this stuff because we'll want to bring back a good amount of salt. Look at that. Wow, we did it. Anybody in here? No? Gold chest. Heck yeah. Oh, that's the whaling blade. Hell yeah. That's what up right there. That is the find. 
Wailing Blade is mint legendary weapon. And we can upgrade it five times. Level three, it's a really good level three weapon. And it has a little bit of a glowing element to it too, so it's nice in dark spots. Good find, good find. Okay, that spot's complete. Let's set our waypoint for this question mark. It's gonna let me, there we are. And 300 meters out, let's do this. Let's actually drink some water so I have a little bit more stamina to work with. And then we're actually going to switch to a salt mine location, set that as our active quest. All right, 50 meters out, it says location below. Do I have to find the entrance for this thing? They're gonna be just down over this way. Oh yeah. Look at this. What did I have my scrappy sword at? This thing needs to get leveled up, but uh, a scrappy sword is a better option at the time or for the time being. All right, we got to go down. Yeah. Egerton salt mines. Oh. Wrong item. Oh god. Don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Whatever you do, don't kill me. I'm just a boy. I'm just a child. Let me alone. Ah. Use this <laughs> this thing that might help. Yeah, there you go, bud. There we go. Hey, you don't need to be so yelly. Mean all the time. Yelly spaghetti. Give me that XP. Nice. Oh. Now we are in the shroud, so... Oop. I have my friggin'... There. Oh, yeah. Mace me. He's gonna take big chunks out of me right now, he's two levels higher, or one level higher than me, but... Also the, uh... Big ol' whacker doodle of the, of the bunch. There we are. Luckily, I don't need a bunch of time to mine the salt. I just need to be able to find it. Those can go away. Okay, let's see, where, if I was a salt deposit, where would I be? Right there. Now we have to give ourselves plenty of time to escape too. Well, yeah, you just pack in the salt. Probably want to grab Okay, let's delete that. Uh, that can get deleted as well. Probably want to grab a few stacks of this since we're here. There is one to the east of the Springlands base as well. But we haven't had that location uncovered. I think that's level 7 enemies too, so... Not something to be taken lightly at the time being. Okay, that's pretty much full up on salt. So, that means we need to leave. And not get killed by these things right now. Twelve XP a bop. Sweet. Jump. Oh man. You just stay over there while I beat this guy into a bloody pulp. There we go. I'm gonna stagger you, boy. Nope. Nope. A for effort. Alright, give me, uh, I hope this is a shroud timer. Nope. Okay, let's see. Uh, believe the spores and the sickness to be. Okay, I can't read that right now. I don't have time. Can't take that either because I don't have room. Let's see here. How can I get out of here? I'm 
Nope. Enshrouded. What about this spot? Is that a timer? No, it's not a timer. It is another thing to be read. Okay. Well, I think we're going to have to just uh, take the L and come back and get our stuff. I'm not seeing a timer reset, and I'm not seeing a, a way out of here. All right, let's head back this way. Decent spot to grab my stuff. Should have probably put a flame altar down there. Oh, there's one right here. Okay, that's not terrible. Sweet. Let's go. Gotta go reclaim my stuff. Let's head back over there. Okay, so my stuff is gonna be down there. Just over that way. And our way up is going to be that contraption. So that's the way we need to go. So let's go down, grab it, and head back out. Nice. Take all. Alright, well I don't know if we're going to be able to get there from this path. But we can definitely look. Hmm. We'll just take the uh, ground route. Oh, that hurt. Follow the road. There's where we need to go, right there. Oh, you can do it. Oh, come on, bud. Oh, no. <laughs> Too steep. Oh, as soon as you get up to there, it's gonna kick you down. All right, it's not even gonna let you. All right, I guess we gotta go over this way. Is there a different way to get up this way? Oh, here we go. Grapple hook. Sweet. Nice. Scroll to read. I sense good fortune. Salt lines every god-forsaken cliff. It fills the air and turns the rum to brine. And yet, I can taste it. There's something waiting for me here. I feel it deep in the rocks, a vibration upon my fingertips. A pulse. The same twitch I feel before drawing an ace. I know it well. A buzz to snap my streak of misery. Good fortune, finally. Bertram. Hey, that chair's nice. I want that chair. Okay. Well, since we know how to get out of there, I'm gonna run back down there and grab those couple of chests that we missed. Yeah, um, should be able to just fly in there from here. All right, six minutes. Let's go. And we'll start on this one over here. Spores and sickness. I believe the shroud to be spores, tiny, almost minuscule fragments that spread through the air, now condensed, heavy and potent. They cling to the airways, eyes, fur, and skin. They spread. The fungi release these spore upon contact, but their roots might have been anchored below us for a long time. We awoke a slubbering malady at the Earth's core when we built the first elixir well, distilled the first elixir. The mysterious wanderer opened the floodgates to the ruin. Balthazar. Alright, what's in this chest? Oh yeah, that's right, that's the forest bow. Alright, what stuff don't I need on me at the moment? I don't need these. I don't need that. This can go. And these... Oh, no. Equip these and delete these. I don't need to hang on to those. Give me this. Excellent. Take that. What's that? Uh, level 4. Alright, sweet. Oh no, this is the one I picked up. Huh? Salvage. Excellent. Next spot. Is 
This is why the sword is sweet. Critter. I'm gonna get stuck in this frickin... No, I don't wanna do it. Alright, excellent. My faculties, sharp as ever. The thumping leads the way. A bold, beautiful pounding. It rattles my bones, but what's my palate? My shy compatriots have no taste for riches, or so it seems, as they depart while I slept. We had just broken into the tunnel where, deep at the end, the wonderful buzzing seemed to sing. No matter. More for Bertram, I say. Forward ho, Bertram. Alright, what's in this one? Ooh, alchemist ring. What is that? Oh, nice. Very nice. Okay, character. Let's see. Which one is this? I... This one just gives me that plus six mana, so I will equip that in place of this thing. There we are. Excellent. Alright, three minutes. Let's see. Is there any other spots to check out? Run in here really quick. This just a... A mining location. Yep. I think so. Yep. Okay. Cool beans. Alright. Well, I think that will do it for now. If I missed anything, then I guess... Oh well, we'll see it again at some point later on. Let's get out of the shroud, head back to base. the shot. There we are, out of the shroud. Nice. Okay, does it make sense? What does this buzz in the wall? Okay, so there is a future quest to do here too that we need to com complete. Uh, how do I get up from here? way. Bunch of flintstone there, nice. Okay, well let's uh, make a flame altar. We gotta grab a couple rock. There we are. Flame altar. place. Alright, cool. So this is our fast travel point for now. Let's head back to base. Alright, sweet. Nice. Alright, let's give ourselves a sleep, and then we will finish up in the morning. Excellent. Okay. So I need to grab my summoning staff. I can put this salt in the drying rack. That would be good. And those, perfect, okay. So that does take a little bit to do its thing. Oh, wait. Oh, it only takes one minute. Oh, okay, cool. We'll have that done in no time. And while we wait for that to finish, let's bring Balthazar out to hang out now, too. Balthazar, what's up, bud? Hey. Uh, hey. Hi. Hello there. Hi. Carpentry. Another set of hands would be useful to us if we ever plan to expand the base. I, for one, could use more storage for my potions. I happen to know the location of another ancient vault. Why not look around? Huh? Eternally magical. We are specks of dust in a whirlwind of stars, my friend. Do you dare to reach out, wishing to grasp a piece of eternity? Perhaps obtaining an eternal spell would suit you. I know one was buried in an underground tomb alongside a dreadful master. You could use it to do a lot of good. Alright, cool, bud. So he'll give us health potions and all that stuff and make us shroud cores. He's gonna want us to make this cane. Okay, cool. Bunch of stuff for us to do with him. 
And let's drop off some of this stuff here. This can go away now. This is what I picked up. Alright, let's equip this one. Nice. Swap that. Salvage that. Drop in stuff that's similar or same. There we go. And then this is the scorching wand. That's the apprentice wand. I can just salvage that too. Salt. Rocks. That. Okay, this one is full up. Wonderful. Okay, so if we take a look at the journey, the journal, we have a uh, scavenger, blah, 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 blah. Speak to Oswald to find out more. We should complete this quest. Let's talk to him. Tell me what you need. The Wailing Blade. You claim the Wailing Blade? I forged it to, for her grasp, a force she left me. Fine, you may wield it in her place. Pierce the Shroud's heart, Flameborn. It's what my daughter would want. Right. Cool, that's complete now. Yeah, we need to make a forge, but we will do that next episode and get here. that up and rolling for a good old Oswald. Let's check our thingies here and see what we're at. We need... I think we'll have enough now. We need four dry fur. And we need five string and three... Uh -huh. cloth. Okay, we'll take that, and take this. And grab that one extra fur we have right here. Cool. And then we just need one more fur, and we should be able to make that. 33 seconds. Let's see what the flame has to say. Another survivor awakened. The alchemist will prove helpful by crafting potions and healing tinctures. Nice. Okay, so journal. Let's see. What do we got for quests? We got all that stuff done. Growing stronger together. This is where we go find the farmer's vault. We could do that. Carpenter assistance will unlock the carpenter. Eternal spell is what we talked to Balthazar just about a second ago. The eternal spell. And then the story of Rot, the other obelisk needing to be found. So if we look and see where that is on the map, it's actually northeast of where we're at. So we have more locations on this side of the Shroud, or the Springlands, to uncover next time. And then we'll start moving north, because the Revelwood is just a hop, skip, and a jump this way. Bunch of stuff to uncover up that way. Cool, so next episode we'll focus on the east side of the Shroud, of the Springlands. And this should be done now. Okay, let's grab this out. Oh yeah, plenty. Cool. So now, we have all the equipment. I oh, yeah. Cool. So now we have all the items that we need to make the backpack. Let's craft that up. What is that? Uh, oh, I need to put the string in my... It's not torn cloth, it was string. Place that back. String, thank you. Eh, hold on. How are ya? Backpack. Mm -hmm. Oh. No, I need both. Not animal fur. Oh my goodness. Okay. One more time. I need torn cloth, string, and dried fur. The animal fur can stay there. <laughs> One last time. Small backpack. And let's equip that bad boy. Character. Backpack. Small backpack. Eight plus slots. And that gives us, yeah, an additional four slots. Eight slots. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh -huh. And then once we get further along in her quest line, we'll be able to get some more backpack, or larger backpacks made as well. But so, yeah, I think that is going to be a good spot to call it. We got everything we set out to accomplish, accomplished today, so that's awesome. Again, we're going to explore the east side next time, and then just see where we go from there. So cool. That's going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you found this episode entertaining at all, make sure to hit that like button and possibly subscribe. If you're watching over here on Rumble, make sure to hit that like button and the follow button, and I would greatly appreciate it. And I got memberships available if anybody wants to check that out. And thanks to the channel members for supporting the channel. 
All right, that's going to do it. Thanks again for watching, and until next time, sharp out.